guys, and welcome back to another Minecraft episode, episode number seven on the Village Cross server. Um, and so in this episode, so in the last episode, let's recap first of all. Uh, we had worked on the thing behind me. I don't want to. I worked on the thing in front of me uh, at the moment. That's why I don't want to do it. And so I've done a bit of the interior. So let's uh, let's just reverse up in here and then close the door. Close it. Ah, just that'll be fine. Okay, let's close the door whilst we're here, and then we'll. There we go. Um. So yeah, as you can see, I've just added some interior things, just, oh, sorry, uh, just some little things to make it a little bit more uh, aesthetic than it was, you know, just, uh, basically just to uh, spice everything up. I've uh, still got the same kind of bed, oh, you just saw it, uh, and uh, as you can see, once I try and not look at it, we've added a small wheat field, and also I've greened up with bone meal along the top with all the stuff. Okay, so this is what I've been working on at the moment. It's not much at the moment, but you can see where I'm kind of getting at it. So this is going to be the main room. This is going to be the dining room. Um, like, I said it in the title of that video, but I never actually said it in the video itself, in the last one. Uh, we are making the Shire. Um, actually, did I say it? I might have said it. I don't know. I can't remember. Anyway, um, so yeah, that's what we're doing in this season. Well, that's going to be our main build, the main thing we're going to work on daily. Um... So yeah, uh, so I just saw something I don't really like about this bit. Hmm, okay, so I've been working on this a bit this afternoon. Uh, oh, that's fine, I think. Basically, then if I have it as... Hmm, I'm just trying to think of a way how to make it so... The only real solution I could think of is having it like that there, that there, and then have because then if I go in here, you can okay that door is also the wrong way around. So then if I go into here, there we go. That's nice. So it's like what I've got over here, but that one's a bit bigger. Oh, actually, I do like. I prefer that style more. So let's. See if we can replicate it. I think it's pretty easy. So, yeah, it's just got a block in the middle. So instead of having that one there, it's got it. As it's here. Oh, but yeah. Um. So first of all, I'm really glad I've got my, my recording all corrected now. So, uh, no more really low quality stuttery videos going forward. Um. Really happy about that. I'm also recording at a different frame rate, so I don't know whether or not that will reflect it correctly. But I can see that it's 100% consistent. I haven't dropped a single, a single frame yet, which is lovely. And then let's just stick that on there, maybe. I don't really like that. Let's. All right, let's try. Let's how does that look? And then stick that there. Hmm. And then I don't really know. I mean, we can make it a proper a circular door. Let's see how that one looks. There we go. Cool. Oh, that's better. Uh, and then we will just see how this looks. Uh, of course. Yeah, that's nice. I like that. And then we'll build it up. So that one is a bit of a trial one because I've never done this kind of building before, like building into the side of mountains. It's something that which I do want to potentially do for next season once we've done our first main base and we will start going on to a second one or a little side project. But this is definitely something that I want to start to work on a little bit more. Um, maybe actually no, that's no, I don't like that. They would never have that in the Shire. Um, maybe it'll look a little bit. Better once. Oh, that's 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 better. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so no, I'm gonna have it so that's like that. But so yeah. Um. So why? So let's see how this looks once I go into. Sorry, I'm I'm getting all sidetracked. That's fine. That's and then we go back into the actual main style of the house. So this is gonna be the main house. This is gonna be the one once we potentially move out of that building up there. This is where we go. So, what I've started on here, like I said, this is going to be the main building, the main part of the building. It's going to be a dining room area, so this is, uh, like, 
where Frodo had had his thing. So what I've done is I'm making a ellipsis shape, so an oval. And I'm going to run out of grass at this rate. And then I think it's on this one, it's yes. One, two, three. So let's see how that looks. There we go. I don't think we have enough blocks to do it all, but I will have a look. Uh, and then, of course, I'm going with the dark oak and the main block of it as the main building block because I don't actually have any others. That's a shame. I am two blocks off. Do I have any in here? I do not. Okay, so I'll fix that in a second. And then I think for the at the floor, I'm either going to go for birch in some areas or oak, like in here. Uh, also need to get some walls so I can put some small carpets down and some paintings probably over here in this building. Anyway, I digress. So, what I'm going to do for the rest of this episode, I'm going to work on this one, try and get it resolved, try and get it all done. Um... And then potentially, so yeah, I'm going to have to fill in all this because I originally, I mean, we could have a little pond over here. That'd be quite nice. Um, I've already kind of see these two paths. Uh, we need to probably work out where we want the rest of the little hobbit houses. So with this one, I'm probably going to have the main part of the building there. Secondly, secondary little part of the building there. And then another little circle here and i think that'll be a nice little house probably hopefully we'll see how it looks after this video has been done um but yeah i'll be right back guys i'm going to uh work on the rest of this and i'll be back with an update so yeah i'll be right back guys okay so it's been a little bit of time uh i've actually been able to do a lot of work in the meantime I've worked on this little bit of the room uh decided to go with birch for the floor um got a little table uh, this one's been like dragged out so it's not like parallel which is fine or like you know what i mean not like that one so it's at an angle uh i might have to the problem is because of the lack of space it's very hard to like decorate as well so the only real things we can do is for example just put like, little crafting benches on the sides also i copped out and put like slabs down everywhere so just like little things like that uh probably put an anvil down there just because also it's four wide on that because I miscounted, but I don't really mind. I like the look of it. I think it means. And then also got a nice little window here. That one's not gonna have a window because there's gonna be grass on that side. Got a small little room here. I'm gonna put a couple of chests. And then yeah, so it's really getting it's really getting along. It's really nice at the moment. I really like the way how it looks. Um, it is working out to be quite a bit of space. So what we need to do now is work out what I want to do for this back room. Uh, we've got a lot more space on this one. Uh, we can either do a... I probably need to do another corridor, to be honest, just so we, there's no way to hit into that. So, do I have the blocks I need, or is there... I do, yeah, okay. So... Oh, I don't think you thought... That's the only bad thing with this design of the building, because there is, like, no room anywhere. So, then... Another set of those. Oh. There we go, and then with all right, we got us doing stairs. That's what I need. We only need four. Yeah, one down here, here. Put that one for there for now, and then oh, oh, and then that should all be. Nice, yeah, there we go. Okay, so, we've got a bit more room to work on this one. We can, like I said, it is going to be the main building, so we might want to do another part of the building there, and another one here. Yeah, I think that would be fine. And then we'll just cut off the, the back of the house here, maybe. So, in that case, then, so we'll do one, two, and I think you can hear my dogs barking. Hopefully not. So there'll be one going through that. So that'll be one doorway. That'll be another entrance to another one. It might be a bit bigger than that one. I don't really know yet. Um, there's gonna be a lot of empty room, but what's perfect with that is if we can just build more into the side of the mountain, more side of the hill. 
Um, so I'm just trying to work out what sort of size, and then how am I going to? Because I could just do that if I wanted to. But uh, I think that would actually be fine, and then that should be the end of the house. So it really gives off a nice, like, small look, which is exactly what I'm going for. And then I just want more, um, some more of those, the oak slabs. Probably go way more in detail, but um, it's just a nice set of houses, so I don't really think I need to. But you see how it's just really tight, like a little labyrinth. It's, it's exactly what I was going for when I uh, had the idea in mind. It's come out even better than I thought it was going to do, so that's great. So let's see how that looks, and then let's build this one across, and then let's also do the rest. I don't think I've got enough blocks. No, I don't. Oh, great. Yeah, that's really nice. And then have uh, some something here, have something there. Then the final set of the house there. Perfect. Okay, so I'm going to be back. I will finish off this one and then we'll get on to doing the top of it, which should be quite easy. All we have to do is really replicate that. So let's see what we've got at the moment. We've got just a random room, which is a three by three. We've got a nice little uh, like oval dining room and then something else over here. We need to think of sizes. Might do... That one's the big one, and that's the little one. Or we might do something else. I don't know. Anyway, I will get back to you guys. I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back. Um, it's been a bit of a little bit. Been a bit, a little bit, a bit of time. Yeah. Okay. That was really weird. Okay, so yeah, like I said, it's been a little bit of time. Um, as you can see, I've got these two little um extras to the house now. Um, it's all looking rather nice on the inside. It's all got that nice effect which I wanted to. I have labelled the ones which aren't like obviously clear. So I've got a small uh, storage room. So what I'm going to do is let me show you what I have the idea for. Uh, do I have them in here? I do. Perfect. So I'm going to do that for two of them. Not have uh, taxes and colours the walls. And then have chest there, chest there, chest there, chest there. Same with the other one. And then that will be probably the finished room. Um, dining room, probably just try and put some more stuff in the corners, try and make it a little bit nicer. Um, but apart from that, that's pretty much a finished room. We need to get some carpets in some areas. These two rooms are the two biggest actually, so when I said that that was going to be the biggest room and the main room, I kind of lied, but it's a little bit of a weird, like, house, uh, layout, I guess you could call it, I guess. So, here is the bedroom. I decided to put it on half slabs, so it's a lot roomy um and then over here is the living room or the main like social area so as you can see we've got quite a bit of work to do and i'll do that all in the next episode um but with regards to everything else with all of this here it's now just covering the entire thing in dirt so it looks uh el natural um so it's got quite a bit of dirt to do uh I was thinking about how to do this, and the easiest way I can think about gathering dirt is literally to go over in this area, I think it is, because there is a, um, what is there, I can't remember, plus I do want to get grass as well, because that would be a lot easier, and I don't have to wait for it all to load to make sure it all looks nice, but it's just, yeah, here it is, okay, so, uh, in the meantime, what I'll do is I will destroy this area, um, Remove as much grass as I can. Uh, maybe try and get. Oh, okay, I didn't actually clear my inventory beforehand, but that should be fine. Um, but yeah, I will remove as much grass. Probably start over there because I'm as far away from my land as possible. So yeah, I will be right back, guys. I said I wasn't. I said I knew I said I wasn't going to do that anymore. But yeah, so it shouldn't be that difficult. There is a ghost block here. Oh well. Um. Yeah, so this shouldn't take very long. Okay. So I will get as much dirt as I can and then get back with you guys. So I've just had a visit from Jeff, if you see him over there. And he said he'd recommend me recording my reaction to this. I'm probably the only one still using Envoles. Where did he. Oh, I heard someone doesn't have a beacon. Aw, oh, what a nice guy. Cool. So, we've got a beacon. <laughs> okay. Yeah, so now we've got a beacon. I guess we've got the shulker box as well. Uh, 
um, so yeah, but I've got all the dirt, um, so let's also, whilst we're here, we'll, we'll sleep quickly, um, whilst we're in the house. We also need to do decoration in the house, um, as well. Um, so yeah, uh, but it's mainly, so, oh, that's so nice. Uh, of course, because I did start later than everyone else, I'm a little bit behind. Cool. Um, oh yeah, I forgot that's the whole point of a, a shocker box. So what we will do is we'll also put down the. So let's first of all let's do this. Um, I will be back with the finished product, and then we'll put down the beacon and we'll call that an episode. I don't know how long we've been recording, all, but I know I've been playing this game for a little bit too long. Um, yeah, I'll be right back. Also, I'm not cutting corners. I'm properly layering up. Should I? I don't think there's much point to do it, but you know, um, there's nothing. Also, I do want to get the general shape of what I'm doing before I actually, um, so, it's not the actual shape of the house, that's going to be like the brush, like the brief out, out and, um, basically this is all I'm going to do, I'm going to go through each layer, and then work out, like, on how many I need to do to get down to the surface, but, Going forward, I definitely do like this way of working out the actual houses before, or the other way how we did it. So with this one, like I said, it is a lot bigger than the first house. Like, and the way how we've done it is we built out the inside first, we've done the skeleton of the house, and then we worked out on the we worked out what we need to do on the outside. Sorry, I'm all stuttery all of a sudden. I think it's because I've got the shelter, the shulker, and the beacon. And then we will do all of that. We'll do that on the outside as well. And of course, we will bow mill the top of it so it gets looking a little bit like that. And then, so yeah, it's this house is really nice. I really like the way how it looks. Um, this once this whole village is done, um, hopefully it'll be really nice. And then we'll just populate it with villagers. They won't breed, but you know, that's fine. We've got the villagers. Oh. We've got the villagers close over in that direction. So. It's really whatever happens, that's absolutely fine. So, like I said, what I'll do first is I'll work out the outline of what I need to do. Um, so, for example, when I go over to Windows like this, I always do the layer on top, layer down here, and then I just bring it out a little bit first, working around the sides. So, for example, that'll be fine, and then working around here, and then, yeah. And then that's how it would work for a window, and then from the inside. So with this one over here, it's the exact same kind of, but it's less layered up. Inside, that's how it looks. See a little bit of things, just like that, yeah. Um, but yeah, like I said, I'll be right back, guys. Um, I will work on this, I'll get this all sorted, and then I will tell you what we're doing in the next episode. So yeah, I'll be right back. Okay, so a little bit off topic, but yeah, i got to walk slow because it's so weird. Um, I was I was getting a, a screenshot for the thumbnail which I've got, uh, which you would have seen already because that's what would have made you click on the video. And I'm guessing it's the server, no, not server, the uh the fancy thing. The I forgot what it's called resource, no, not resource pack. The shader. There we go. That's making it do this, but I've never didn't realize it affected. Fence post to act like leaves. That's the thing. And also, that's really weird as well. That was just switching in and out a second ago. Anyway, um, as you can see, this thing with shaders is so goddamn nice. It's really got the nice effect where it's like you can tell it's underground, you can tell that um, there's nothing really. That it's just earthy, you can tell it's really homey as well, and then, yeah, so, um, all I've done recently is that, and then, just little things over here, I wonder what the video looks like, because, uh, last time I recorded with shaders, it wasn't that, my actual computer's absolutely fine, but yeah, as you can see, we've got up here, and what I was going to go with is, let me get my cursor, is we're going to go with an L shape, so down here it's going to be quite shallow, and then up here it's going to be a lot more higher, like this. Just a couple more layers. 
um, and then wrap this back around here. Um, so this will then connect with that. So it's going to be hopefully look quite natural. And then, yeah, so, and then we're going to do farms over there. We're going to have an actual building like it is in the Shire. Uh, I'm sorry, let me just quickly come back and then um, out the shaders off. Okay, so, so yeah, um, completely different on the shaders. So, I need to get some more dirt because I actually ran out when I was basing it all down. Um, but yeah, we're going to finish this off here. Um, I'll probably do this all in the next episode though. And then we'll also finish off the interior for that place and then this place as well. We'll try and get something a little bit more homey as well. Um, but... For this to be our main house, this is a real big possibility because I like the, I really do like the way how it's turned out. I like the fact that I like the light, I like the uh, the wood used, um, I like the space of the rooms. It's not too big, it's not much really small, but uh, I'm I'm not complaining. Um, and then also we will uh, place down this beacon, which I've never done before. Uh, let's let's sleep first. I think that's a good idea. Um, that is a door, okay. Yeah. Um, yeah, okay, I can't sleep, perfect. Yeah, as you can see, I've taken the screenshot, so, um, but you've already seen that, so, yeah. Um, uh, I don't really know how to take the picture, because, where is that skeleton? There you are. Jah! Dead yet? No, you're not dead. There we go. Okay, so let's place this one just here. I think. Okay, so if I remember correctly, that's probably it. I think. I hope so. But big thank you to Jeff for uh, uh, giving this to me because it is really needed. Because um, so what am I gonna put on this? I don't know. Okay, so I don't think it's this many. Yeah, let's just keep on... He would have given us the right amount, surely. Hopefully. Yes. Okay, so I think... That's the right amount, and then the beacon goes on that one. So, the... Yeah, maybe? For a full beacon? But we will also... Oh, no, I don't think it's right. I think this is the layer. No, is that right? I don't know. I'm really confused. Um, Maybe he gave us one block... Hopefully gave us one block extra, because then we can use it for... Uh, the actual beacon and activating it. If not, I'll have to go get a diamond or an iron block. Or an iron uh, beacon. Somewhere. I am very poor at this. Place one in there. Perfect. Okay. Um, but yeah, this is gonna call it an episode here. Uh I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. I really enjoyed making it. I've really got a lot of inspiration at the moment to continue to make videos and not take a, a really long hiatus and as well to finish this area. Um Well damn, I do not have any or Okay. Oh no, he gave us the full one. We got two achievements at once. Very nice. Um, but no, I, I'll, I'll put that in there. I'll do that in the next episode. And I really hope you guys did enjoy this video. Uh, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you in the next adventure. Peace.